This is a stimulus check update for May 11th. In this video, I'm going over the current check delivery timeline, some important updates, as well as answering your questions you leave for me in the comments. But first, I'm David, and if you want the latest stimulus check information, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. I'm publishing the latest updates when it comes to receiving a second stimulus check. Wednesday, May 13th is going to be the next big round of direct deposits. It's covering a lot of different categories, especially SSI. So if we go to the SSA.gov website and we scroll down a bit. Uh, so this is for social supplemental Social Security income recipients. So big date here. If SSI recipients who do not file 2018, 2019 and do not have a representative payee, you're going to get your check. May 13th by direct deposit or direct express card unless you went to the non filers tool and gave your direct, uh, bank account for a direct deposit. You're also going to receive that. And if you are not getting your money digitally, then you will have your paper check mailed out on May 15th. So it could take up to 14 days for delivery time. So expect delays. IRS has been delaying everything lately. If you want some additional resources helping you figure out when you would actually get your check, if you are SSDI, SSI, whatever, if you have a, a payee, how it works, uh, you just click this link here. I'll leave a link to that down in the description below. And it helps you figure out what your situation is, if you need to take any action or just wait for your check. So if you file 2019 taxes or whatever, it's very straight to the point. And then there's a chart letting you know exactly you know, if there's no action required by you or if there's something you need to do or when you could expect your payment. Unfortunately, there is no set date for veterans still. I went to the VA website, looked at every part of the website, the FAQ, everything, and there is nothing in regards to receiving stimulus check. And once again, to the veterans, thank you so much for your service, for protecting our country and our freedom. It's a shame that veterans have to wait last in line in order to get a notification date of when they're expected to get paid and to even get paid in general. Thankfully, according to my comments, many veterans did get paid, which is great, but still to be treated like this is not fair. It's very shameful. And when it comes to paper checks, May 15th, Friday is when you should expect to have your check mailed out. If you made 40,000 or less, it's not going to be in your mailbox this date, but it'll be mailed out and it could take up to 14 days delivery time. Next, another important update and announcement. So if you are waiting to get your check and you haven't yet provided the IRS with your direct deposit information, you have until Wednesday in order to provide the IRS with your information so that you could get direct deposit and not have to wait a long time to get a paper check. Uh, there's a lot of delays reported with that still. So if you just go to the get my payment tool and that is uh, this tool right here. So the get my payment tool and this is where you would either check your payment status or provide your bank account information for direct deposit. So if you do that by noon on Wednesday, although it doesn't say what, what stand, like if it's Easter standard time or not, I recommend doing it before Wednesday because if you're like me, I'm a really big procrastinator, I would wait until the last second and that's probably what a lot of other people are gonna do and it, it might even crash the site the same way that the site crashed when it first came out. Also, just a quick reminder, if you fall under any of these categories, social security retirement, disability benefits, railroad retirement benefits, veteran affairs benefits, or supplemental security, social security income, uh, so you're gonna get automatic payments. There is no action to be taken. Now we're gonna go into my comments and I'll answer the questions that you leave for me. If you want your question answered, leave it down in the comments below and I'll try to get to it in my future video. So first comment comes from India La Loca. I just called my direct express card and it says pending $1,200 will be in my card May 13th, 2020 at 1am. So this is great news, India. Thanks for letting us know if you have direct express card, you could call up the number and see if there is a pending deposit, assuming you're not able to get through the get my payment tool. Or if you have the app on your phone, you could see if there's a pending deposit as well. Sometimes a pending deposit will show up three to four days before, so you could see if a payment is coming that way. Next question comes from Roberto Cardona. So 
where is that money from the people that do the taxes this year? So I'm assuming you're talking about if you filed your 2019 taxes, uh, the IRS is backed up with doing 2019 taxes and hasn't processed it yet. So if you didn't do your 2018 taxes and, you're, and you did your 2019, there could be delays with that. Also, it depends on how you got your refund. If it was through a tax preparer like H&R Block, TurboTax, Jackson Hewitt, there's been reported delays, although a lot of those have been cleared up. If you received your tax refund via paper check, then you're going to wait, uh, according to this schedule here, uh, to get your paper check. Next question comes from Ann Paylor. So my mom is social security survivor's benef uh, beneficiary and does not file taxes. She does not have to use the non-filer tool, correct? So yes, you are correct. She will receive her payment, the same, uh, the stimulus check, the same way she receives her monthly payments uh, being on survivors. So there's no additional action to be taken. And if she hasn't received it yet, there could be a lot of factors there. There's been delays with everybody. Hopefully May 13th is the day if you receive direct express card or direct deposit. If it's a paper check, then it'll be mailed out on May 15th. Next question comes from Witchy Mom. So I am a representative payee for my child. So when will they get their check? And what date will I get mine? Do you know? So unfortunately, a lot of people have been commenting about representative payee information. So the only information we know is this, uh, according to ssa.gov. The IRS has not yet determined when payments will be made to someone who did not file 2019-2018 tax return who has a representative payee. So I'm really sorry if you fall into this category. Unfortunately, you're left in the dark. There is no date and there's no information, but stay tuned to the channel. I'll update you as soon as I get information on what's going on with payees and representative payees. If you still have a question, leave it down in the comments so I can answer it in the next video. If you are feeling stressed and anxious still that you haven't gotten your stimulus check, my sister, I asked her to do another video to help relieve some of that stress. She's a confidence coach and she's really good at what she does. So I recommend clicking her link down in the description below to help bring some relief and positivity in your day today. If you're looking for free money or free stocks, I have a spreadsheet down in the description below and it has about 10 investment apps. Just for signing up, you could get a free stock or two, which could be valued anywhere from $5 to up to $1,400. So if you want, you just sign up, get the free stock, and then you could de uh, deposit that into your account. If you wanna watch more stimulus check videos, you could click either one of these links over here. Stay safe, take care, and if you haven't already, I hope you get your money soon. Thank you for watching.